Today marked the end of a weekend full of hoops out at Mizzou Arena. The Tiger women's team was looking for its fifth straight win against these guys, Jackson State. Today, Jeff City alum Sarah Linthicum in the starting lineup again today for the Battle of the Tigers. Robin Pinchton's group 10 and 1 so far to start the season. First quarter triples are flying. Haley Frank knocks it down from the wing for the first bucket of the game, far from the last for her. Minutes later, keep it going. Haley Troop gets it to Linthicum in the paint. Basket is good, and we're off to a hot start here. Five nothing in favor of the hometown Tigers. Jackson State, though, giving them some trouble down low in the first half. Angel Jackson nails the hook shot to make it seven to four. Jackson State has a lot of height on this Mizzou team. Mizzou fighting back, though. Lauren Hansen, nothing but net drills it. It's a 13 10 ball game. MU still in front. And Tigers trying to hang on to this lead. It's Frank from the corner. She found her groove today, and Mizzou stays up by four. Just a minute to go until half. Hanson driving, step back, nails the jumper. Mizzou is going into the locker room with just a slight lead 35 27 over Jackson State. Back from the break, starting the same way as the first half. Frank from the corner, who was working for her all day. The three is good. Mizzou. Comes out ready to grow that lead a little bit, get a little bit of separation. Linthicum kicks it out to Caitlin Gilbert. The Notre Dame transfer drains one from downtown. Mizzou with their first 10-point lead of the game, 44-34. Haley Troop, she wants in on the three game. Knocks down a contested one at that, and Mizzou goes on a 10-0 run to start the final quarter of play, and they do not turn back from there. Mizzou closes it out, winning 74-61, led by a big game from Haley Frank with 21 points and four boards. As a team, the Tigers shot over 66% from the three-point line. The big shift, though, in the second half started with stepping up on defense. At times, I felt like we needed to just bring some energy, so I kind of just used my defense to be able to get the crowd going and get my team going. You know, they've started this tradition where they're talking about things before we even get in there at halftime. And, you know, they'll talk about it, they'll write it on the board, and then we'll come in and we'll kind of compare notes. And, you know, they were spot on. They, they knew the adjustment that we had to make defensively. Um, we got spread out a little bit uh, at times um, defensively, and we really wanted to take away the paint. Extended highlights in the full post-game press conference from today's win can all be found on our website, abc17news.com.